hey, Lucy. Do you sleep well? Yeah. Oh, what the hell? All right, sir. <coughs> yeah, I did. Phew, okay. Anyway, I've been rewatching this first episode, and I gotta say, we did an amazing job. Yay! You know what? I sometimes wonder who watches episodes, you know? Um, I don't know. I'm sure our audience is great. <laughs> oh, Morgan, 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 Morgan. Morgan, 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 no Morgan. Well, 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 Morgan. Look at you! You finally have your own stupid show. Some stupid competition for a, a sandwich? Hmm. Mmm, you know what, Bradcaster? Even if that sandwich didn't do any magic stuff, I'd eat that up. Cool, Boxman Boss. Well, okay, why are we watching this? This show sucks. Well, Arya, Morgan has a show, and we have a network. Cashworth Productions, we can make a deal with him where we get complete control over his show and do whatever we want with him. Uh, what? Well, he's not stupid. What makes you think he's gonna accept that? Audio. We own so many good shows. Billy the Dog, Swag News, and it'd be stupid, so stupid for him not to partner with us. That last name is weird. Shut what now? Uh, guys, could you get over here? We're having a lot of show making the next Billy the Dog episode. Sorry, I don't know why I said that. That's a force of habit. <sighs> okay. Guys, Billy the Dog and friends needs our help. Oh, that reminds me. I have something to talk about with the Billy the Dog and friends director. Let's go. Oh, but dude, I hate Billy the Dog and friends. Can I do something else? Uh, yeah, actually. We need to train our synthetic vessels on how to work here. You can go do that. All right. <gasps> yes, finally. Guys, thank God you're here. We really need to get this new episode out, but your AI actors are always screwing stuff up. I hate Billy. That's me. I hate these AI things. Could you please tell me how to work them? Oh, well, you know what, Billy? I know just how to fix this problem of yours. Well, let's hear it. I'll stop it being your problem. <laughs> you're fired. And we're giving this show to someone else. Whoa. Wait, what? What do you mean? I started the show, you can't just take it from me. Oh, yes, I can. What? Well, why? What do I want to do now? What do I do? Well, <laughs> you haven't really been that efficient for our company. So, we got a synthetic version to replace you. What? Show them, Audio. I think I'm making my process. What is that thing? Well, pack your things, Billy. Audia, you can sort this out. Alright. Alright, hey bums. I meant to teach you what our company's about, but I'm seriously too lazy. But hey, Big Brad gave me this video playing in case y'all won't listen to me, but I'll just let y'all watch it long. <laughs> what? What? Oh, whatever. Welcome. To Cash with Productions. My name's Bradcaster, the CEO alongside Audia and the Boxman Boss. We create amazing shows, and recently we started our largest project yet Sloth Eye. Listen, making shows is not easy, and we're always trying to generate high quantity content in the quickest and easiest way possible. So, in order to do that, we've created Sloth Eye, a life form generator. Here's how it works. Our studio has a special generator room that can generate physical objects and life forms. All you need is some training data. For objects, you just need to chunk in some materials in, type in a prompt, and press generate. For creating life forms, <laughs> you just need to. If you're watching this video, you're a product of this generator. And we need you to obey everything we say and act exactly how you're told. If you don't, then you go with the rest of them. My hair looks really bad in that video. You don't have hair. What? Hey, shut up. Uh, everyone, shut up. Shut the heck up. And let's take this from the top. And action. Wow, 
Today's a great day, Bloomberg, right? Thank you, Fox. Why am I even doing this again? You're the director. Class. Stupid <laughs> fake things. Well, guys, Billy the director is out of here. Yeah, Brad, why do we have these physical generated things? Wouldn't that be just easier to make videos? I would, but come on, have you seen how those look? Yeah, true. Anyway, where were we? This guy has always been one step ahead of us, always putting us in second place ever since he just appeared one day. But you know what? I think I can finally turn the tables. How? We'll give him a contract that states will help him, but we'll take full control over the show. Over time, we we'll ruin this show, no one will like it, and we take everything good for it ourselves. Then, we just cancel it. Sounds good. Oh, okay. So soon, my OC Morgan will become my OC Morgan. Okay, rise and shine team, it's time for some practice. Ah, not again! Oh, I slept so bad last night. Yeah, and it's your stupid brother's fault. I don't think I slept that all last night because of him. Yeah! <laughs> Will you shut him up somehow? He's your brother, you're responsible. Ugh, fine. Aw, oh, damn it, I lost that fly. Well, uh, why don't you go find another one? Maybe we're as far away as possible from here. No! I like that one specifically. Grr. Oh my god, just let me deal with this. Ah! Barks! What the hell? Hey, get up. It's time for the contest soon. Ugh, I slept horribly. Ah, good morning, everyone. How did you all sleep? Oh, I slept amazing, Emotia. Oh, that's good to hear. What a stupid contest. I'm a celebrity. I don't deserve to be sleeping here in the forest, honestly. What about you, Svagoras? How did you sleep? Damn it. <sighs> well, of course, I slept great. Good thing because I need the rest. Being so rich and famous is hard work. Oh? Damn, Svagoras. How do you handle being so popular all the time? Well, you see, Slippy, it starts with a good morning routine. First of all, I like to eat Grr, stupid Svagoras. He knows damn well if he let me express myself. I'd be way more popular than him. Even back when we first became friends, I was the popular friend in school. He stole it all from me. <sighs> okay, look, John Daniel, I don't really want to be a part of this anymore. But you can't let Sigaras do this you forever. Yeah, I know, right? So why don't you do something about it? Well, because I... There's no one I can talk to for advice. Seriously? Yes, who is there that I can talk to for emotional support? You're a moron! Look! All right. Okay then. Thanks, smart guy. I'll talk to her later. God. Okay, guys. First of all, how did everyone sleep? Bad. Sleep? Ha! <laughs> because of them. Oh. Anyway, here's my big plan for now. If we win the challenge, we can have a good time, whatever. If we lose, we need to get Marks, Joe, or maybe Dr. Faze out as soon as possible, okay? Why? Because they're all big threats and jerks! Marks manages to be a jerk and can still manipulate everyone into liking him. Who has the manipulators? Ye! Well, me and Fabian were never really there to see how yet, so we don't really mind him. Uh, fine! Is there anyone else you guys want to target? I can't really think of anyone worse than these guys. <laughs> never mind. Everyone, I hope you're all awake. Because it's time for the first challenge. Game Morgan! Oh, hi, Dr. Unfazed. Of course we'd all be awake. What kind of conditions are these? We need somewhere to sleep right now. Well, you shouldn't be surprised. 
I never clarified that you'd be having places to stay on this island. No, Morgan. It doesn't matter if it's a tour or not. It's a basic right. Give us somewhere to stay right now or we're leaving. Well, don't be so harsh. I see he has some crates full of supplies. Maybe he's gonna build something for us. Well, actually, these materials are for something else. But, oh, fine. That's a good idea. I guess I got to work on your houses. <gasps> Morgan, Morgan, instead of building houses for them, why don't you make them do it for the first contest? <gasps> That's a great idea. Thanks, my sugar noodle muffin. All right, guys, if you all want places to stay so bad, why don't you make them for today's challenge? I'll scatter these crates all around the island that contain random materials. Some useful, some not. Whichever team builds the worst base by sunset will have to vote off one of their members. But what about our advantage? Oh yeah, right. Uh, team Tumble can get crowbars for having a better team name. All right, now start. All right, team. I really want all of us to do well, especially since we have the advantage. So I would like to be team leader. Any objections? Yes. Um, what the tuna? I want to be team leader. I'm the most sensible here. I want to be team leader because, um, well, me being so guys should be enough, right? Oh, well, um, hmm. How about this? We can take turns. I'll be the leader today, and tomorrow it'll be switchy. Then you, Svegoris, then back to me. How does that sound? Ah, uh, fine. Meh, yeah, fine. Switch it to the right now! Jeez, what? Can I try to make Emotia look this way? I want her to see me opening this box all super manly. Why? Because I want to impress her. Why? Because I like her. Why? She's cute. Why? I'm about to use this crowbar for something else. Alright, fine. Uh, hey, Ammonia, look at us. We have something to show you. Jeez, you should be more obvious next time. What is it? Oh, shoot! <laughs> Ow! Uh, nothing. Never mind. Yeah? What do those guys think they're doing? Ebony is my best friend, and- What about me? Oh yeah, you two are killers, whatever. What are they doing? Ebony should only talk to the two of us. Why? I don't really mind her talking to other people, not like I should. It's not my business. When it should be, who knows what these people could do to her, or us. They might force us to work in a prison again. I think you're genuinely insane. Yeah, they're all insane. Jeez, what? I'm right here. As you know, I'm the leader for today's challenge, and I'm giving you the amazing job of creating a blueprint or design for our base. Sims, you're good at art and stuff. Oh, uh, sure. I'll get to work on that. Lord knows I can't open these crates anyway. I mean, just look at me. No, Spark, it's fine. I trust you. You don't have to. It's so hard opening this, like. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> Alright team, I elect myself team leader for this challenge. Any problematic, I mean, objections? Yes, I wanna be team leader! Why? Not like anyone's gonna listen to you or for me. I'm gonna listen to him. Ha! Boris, let Marks be leader. Fine! Okay team, here's my plan. Me, Dr. Face, Joe, and Server, we're going to sabotage Team Tapo. The rest of you will do the challenge. Sound good? Meh, I don't care. Meh, I don't care more. No! Alright, perfect. See ya. Well, let's do this! Yeah, this doesn't really seem like the safest thing. We need to find some other thing we could use to open these crates. Anyone got any ideas? I can use my pocket knife! What the hell? Pine cones? In what world do we need to use these? Well, Morgan did say some were gonna be useless. That's true, but these aren't. I have just the perfect use for these. Which is? Throwing them at you. Alright, Amodia, I'm done. Okay, let me see. Well, it looks great, but what about the inside? Oh, uh, I guess we can come up with that when we get there. Um, okay. Stupid of Emotia for not assigning me to team leader. If she, we all be basically done by now. She asked if anyone had any problems with her being the leader, and I know damn well you heard her. No, I mean, what? No, she didn't. I didn't hear that. Well, sort it out then. Maybe she'll put you in the turn system they made. Uh, but stop wasting time, Sippy. Go open some crates. Fine. Yo, a trampoline! Let's go! Hey, Ricky, look at this! Ah! Hey, ah! So many people are running up to me today. What goes around comes around, what can I say? Anyway, you're a robot, right? So why don't you use some, like, super speed or whatever to build the base for us? Well, I would love to, but I'm only an emotional support robot, 
so I don't have robot powers like that. I mean, if you were making an emotional support robot, why would you need to give them super speed? Oh, well, uh, that's true. Well, maybe I could give you some cool powers. I've made machines before, even if they lead to some bad things. I mean, I don't really know. You seem chill and all, but we just met. Ah, uh, okay. Well, to help the team, I'm gonna have to gain her trust. Demonia! Uh, who was that? Oh, uh, it was the smart guy. How'd you get in here? Well, good thing you told I don't trust him, because I really don't. It gives me a bad vibe. Oh, really? Why? Look at him, like. Does he seem like a good person to you? Yes. <laughs> Alright, guys. We need to progress fast. Team Top is doing pretty well. Uh, I'm too lazy. Uh, I want a lollipop. Not now, Sugly. Dennis, stop annoying my team. We need to start the space now and fast. Fine. Thank you. You son of a bitch. I want lollipop. Not now! Wait, actually, I have an idea. What? Okay, since Swiggly is so energy filled and goes crazy when he gets candy, how about we give him a lollipop so he'll go all crazy and break some crates? Where are we gonna get lollipops? Oh, okay. Hey, Swiggly, want a lollipop? Gasp! Yes, please! Alright, but you have to use your energy to break down these 10 crates. Okay, sure! So <gasps> tired. <gasps> oh, what? Damn it, Swiggly! All of that was for nothing! Don't worry guys, I have something even better than lollipops. It always helps me get energized. Uh, what the hell is that, James? Uh, sugar? What else should it be? Oh, uh, never mind. Good Whoa, job, Swiggy. Let's go! Ha ha ha! Well, 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 James. For a guy not care that much, you really seem to care about this contest. I mean, yeah. Why would I sign up for this if I didn't care? Wh why did you sign up if you don't care? Seems pretty contradictory, huh? Do you want to get kicked into the sun again? I honestly think it's funny how... Worth it! Well, anyway, let's get started on our base. Any ideas? I don't care, okay? Let's make it out of doors, walls, and a ceiling, maybe. Ooh, I know. Let's make it out of straw, because our team name is Strawtiv. Get it? Strawtiv? Strawtiv? Damn it, Clark! What is that stupid switch hiding from me? I'm gonna find out one day. Spark, please calm down and respect other people's boundaries. Yeah, I know, but like, there's something so intriguing about it. Flicky was fine with showing me his. I guess it's more of a what does he have to hide thing. Whatever. All right, guys, sunset's coming. You'd better get to work on those bases. Shoot. All right, guys, so here's a summary of our plan. We're all going to use those TWFM to blast a hole into their base, probably making them lose. Then we'll jump out and take the crowbars and materials. How's that sound? Sure. Sure. All right. Actually, guys, I think the four of us are the smartest on the team. So why don't we form an alliance? The world's strongest, Gary, and Dave Morris. Sure. Calm down. Uh, I don't hate Boris. Why do you all hate him so much anyway? He ruined my life. He stopped my plans. He's a massive bomb. Well, to me, he just seems to be in a bad mood all the time. Not evil or anything. Shut up, dude. You only say that because he said you looked good last episode. He didn't mean that. And no, I think Joe and Dr. Face have at least decent reasons. What's that noise? But you've never even heard of him before the show, Marks. You have no reason to hate him so much. Oh, really? Well, as a matter of fact... Ow, I guess. Hey, it's Trotiv. Uh, what are they doing here? Oh, uh, shoot. Alright, guys, let's do this! Where the hell's Servar? Oh, whatever. Guys, let's go back! Hey, what? Our base! Guys, do something about them! If you say so! GET BACK HERE! Guys, what's going on? Oh, hey you, here's some materials and crowbars. Get to work. Their base is pretty much done and... What kind of base is this? Whatever it is, it's clearly nowhere near done. Did you guys have any plotting or anything? I mean, it has doors and walls. Wow, this is a... Uh, what's the word? Crazy. Hey guys, do you want something to actually fight for? What?
Sudden. Yes, the final crate. It's all mine. Oh, really? <laughs> well, well, well. If it isn't you again, Ammonia, I. Ow! Yes, I got it! Uh, what is this? It's glue. Oh, uh, glue? What good is this for us? Uh, I don't know, but you gotta find out soon, because there's like 10 seconds left, lol. Huh? Well, guys, I have an idea. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Uh, what are you doing? Time's up. Now let's see how good those bases are. Whoa, guys, this is great. I really like how it looks. Let's see the inside. What? What the? This? I mean, it looks cool, but did you guys have any planning for this? Nah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Wow, this looks amazing. Wow, everyone has their own place to stay. Where's mine? Uh, you're not on this team, so you don't have a room. Zero out of ten. Yeah, I know, right? So rude. I didn't get a room either. What the hell? I doubt Strada can come up with anything worse. Dear God! What the heck happened here? We made use of the glue? Yeah, but at what cost, Dr. Faced? Let me look in here. Bro, guys, honestly, did you guys have any planning with this? I mean, if it has doors and walls. Gosh, and what kind of name is Strada's house anyway? We couldn't think of a word for house that started with S, so we just put S in front of house, creating South. Well guys, I think it's easy to say that even without you guys being used as building blocks, this base sucks. I'll definitely be seeing wild elimination tonight. And by the way, what a missed opportunity to make the base out of straw. Uh, oh, um... Uh oh. Great job on this challenge, everyone. Let's keep these wins coming. We're even getting an advantage again in the next challenge. That's right, guys. And we're definitely winning tomorrow, too, since I'm going to be the leader. Um, no. Switchy is. You're going to be after him. Hmm. Well, I'm not really surprised that the team with the advantage won. You'd be surprised how little that happens, actually. Oh, hey, guys. Here's my amazing, awesome plan. For, for Boris. Sure. Okay. Uh, no, I'm not voting for Boris. Well, uh, why'd you even come here then? Get out of here. Huh. Okay, guys, I say we vote for... No. Let me finish! Okay. I say that Mark can actually wait a bit, because you guys are not gonna listen to me. So we need to vote for Dr. Unfazed. Mmm, okay, sure. Yes, agreement! Yeah, I mean, you can't deny he kind of ruined the base for us. And even then, I think we should get him out anyway. He's Dr. Unfazed! True. Who's gonna stay and who's in the ditch? Find out in the next wish for a witch. Alright, Stradiv. How was your guys' day? Great, I assume. I got kicked into the sky. First time. Well, guys, it's time for the first elimination of the show. Lucy, why don't you explain it to them? Why do I have to explain everything? It's whatever. Okay. You all will go to the boathouse over there and cast a vote for whoever you want eliminated. Whoever gets the most votes will be the first eliminated from the war for more. And the rest of you will get a sandwich for being safe. Today's sandwiches are ham and cheese sandwiches. That's right. Go cast your votes, everyone. All right, now let's get to it. Martin, Fabian, Dennis, you guys are in luck today because you three are the first safe. Yes! Sandwiches! Yes. To our server on Maxwell. Good. I deserve this for dealing with a brawl day. So is Joe. That rhymes. Uh, okay. James and Barr are also saying with one vote each. Wow, I wonder who voted for him. Nah, whoever was, was, I probably don't, don't care. care. Marx is also safe. Yes! Mm. Now we have our bottom three. 
Boris, Dr. Face, and Swiggly, which honestly I'm not surprised about. What's that supposed to mean? I'll tell you what, Swiggly, you are an immature silly brat who has no common sense or sense of urgency. Dr. Face, you are an insane, retired world dominator that completely ruined your team's base today. And Boris, you're not much better. Huh? You just talked about a psychopath criminal! I know. You managed to have everyone hate you, and take out your stress on everyone close to you. I don't remember you acting like this. <sighs> Despite all this, Swiggly is safe. Yay, I thought I was gonna be first out again. Ow! Now we have our bottom two. Who's gonna get out? I don't know. Well, actually I do, but whatever. Let's show the results! Well, whatever. I have so much allies, there's no way I'm gonna get out. You're a bum! This sandwich tastes good, but I don't know if that's because it's just good or I'm happy to be safe. Thank you! Well, come on, Dr. and Face, let's go! Well, Dr. and Face, how does it feel being the first eliminated? Girl, I hate it! I'm gonna get revenge on all of you guys one day! Just set me up already! Wait a second! First, do any of you guys wanna come up and say your final goodbyes to Dr. and Face? Well, uh, it's a shame you have to get eliminated, but we're gonna try to get rid of Boris next time. Yeah, your sacrifice won't be in vain. This was a sacrifice? Well, no, but that's not a goal. Okay. Well, we'll miss you, Dr. Faze. No, we won't, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Time's up! Bye, Dr. Faze! What? Huh? Where am I going? What? What is that place? Answer me, Morgan! Yeah, you won't get away with this, guys. Help! Uh, I don't think we can. Yeah, I hate you, Morgan, and I hate the rest of you guys. You all suck. Hello, guys. I'm talking to you. Doctor and Phase, just shut up, man. You've fallen so low down the social hierarchy that none of us care that you hate us. It's like the fact that we all breathe. Oh, Doctor and Phase hates me. Whatever. Oh, uh, so. I'm sorry. A bit late for that. No, please, I'm sorry. Please don't eliminate me, please. How is he not gone yet? Oh, right. Okay, bye, Dr. Faced. No, please, I'm seriously sorry. Glad to not deal with him anymore. Well, guys, how will Sharaf do now that they have one less member? Probably better. Will Team Topper win again? I would hope not. Will Boris keep interrupting me? Yes. Find out the actual answer to these questions on the next episode of The War For More. For now, stay, stay tuned, tuned for, for more. more. <laughs> hey guys, it's me, Boris Online, and as you can see, I'm feeling a little spooky this episode because it's October and this episode showed us the scary bad guys. Ah! Be sure to subscribe or else you get replaced with an AI version of yourself. What am I doing in my life? Um, anyway, thank you guys for watching the second episode of The War For More. Some new voice actors got their voices in this episode and we saw the first challenge and elimination. Wowee! Because of school and stuff, this episode was a lot harder to finish on time. So I'm really glad it's finally out. And personally, I think episode 3 will be even better. I mean, I'm probably going to say that about every next episode, but whatever. As usual, be sure to subscribe if you enjoyed, and hit the notification bell so you can see the newest videos as soon as they come out. And as always, I'll see you all next time. Yeah, 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 yeah.